Hey everyone, it's Leanne. Welcome to another video on my YouTube channel. I have a quick card to share with you today. This is a digital card that I created for my nephew, Lucas. It was his birthday this week. And so I did a Roblox themed card for him. I did this all in Procreate using my iPad Pro and my Apple Pencil. So I have the video showing my sketch and how I planned out the card. And I just wanted to share this quickly with you. It was a really fun project. So I use um, a pencil style brush first to do my sketching. I'm using an HB pencil and this is a standard brush inside the Procreate app. And sketching out some of the artwork, I didn't really know what Roblox was. I knew it was a video game. Um, it's an app game that he plays on his iPad. So his sister, my niece, kind of gave me some pointers and helped me out with this. And she instructed me that his favorite part of Roblox is playing the mining section. So I guess that's where you harvest gems and dig dirt and stuff. I don't really know that much about it, but I did uh, look up some images and found some reference material, which helped. And so this is kind of the process that I took. I did this completely digital and for two reasons. Um, first, because I wanted to create something that was unique and specific to him, something that he could relate to um, and that he would identify with. And so he loves Roblox and I knew that this was what I wanted to do. I also did this completely digital because he's really into bright neon colors right now. I think it's his age group. They said this is kind of like a trendy thing with them. And so I wanted to do this in a digital color and make it nice and bright. And so almost brighter than I could probably get with the Copic markers that I have on hand. And so I did this completely digital, colored it in in Procreate, created the card at the right size. I popped this into Illustrator when I was done and exported it as a PDF and then printed it. I tried printing it at home on my printer, but my printer's a little bit weak and it and it has, it's having some problems. So I took it to my local Staples and printed it on cardstock there. And the colors came out beautiful. They were nice and bright. It was exactly what I wanted. And it was a lot brighter than my printer gave me. Um, so I was really happy with the result. And coloring this was really fun too because it's kind of um, like digital coloring. So you can kind of let your mind go and enjoy creating the colors and the shapes and the shadows. I did everything by hand. So I created the letter type. Um, I freehanded most of it. I did Lucas's name in a Roblox letter style. So it's kind of this block um, lettering that they have the Robux Roblox logo in. So that's the style that I used for his name too. And his nickname is Skydiver Lucas. So I put that little touch in there too because I wanted it to be very personal to him. And he was really excited when he seen this card. He knew exactly what it was right away, which was great because I wasn't really sure what I was creating. And uh, he really enjoyed it. And I think that it made his gift a little bit more special just because I took the extra time to create something that he identified with. Now, when I got to this point, I had remembered that my niece said he liked the mining and I had forgot to add that in. And so I decided to put some icons to the left and right of his name just above there. You can see me sketching them out. And so I did um, a pickaxe and then a gem uh, jewels at the, the other side. So that would kind of bring in the mining reference too. And my niece was also really excited when she seen this card because she knew she had helped with it and had given me some pointers on what to create. And so it felt special to her too. And she was very excited to share it with him as well. So it was a really fun, um, meaningful uh, birthday present that I could give to them. So I was really excited about this. Here's a look at the final. And again, I printed it at Staples on cardstock, super easy, came out really nice and bright. I really enjoyed it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video too. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe so you're notified as I post more videos. And I have some more card making videos coming shortly um, to my channel, so be sure to subscribe and hit the bell so you're notified as they're posted. Thank you again for watching.